Okay, how to save a action replay DS that is bricked. You clean the cartridge, you put it in, no matter how many times you turn it on, clean it, blow on it, nothing ever comes up. It's always just a white screen. Or a Nintendo logo might come up and it'll go to a white screen and then nothing happens. Okay, this will be how to fix this. What you need is two other action replays, maybe one, but for this demonstration, I'm showing you two. One is upgraded to firmware 1.71, the other is 1.55. There's no way to tell which one this is on because it can't even load the DS, so that's why you need two. You could get lucky and get one, but anyway. So, where do you see version 1.71? What are you talking about? Well, when you put it in, that's how you know which firmware you're on, 1.71, okay? Now the trick is gonna be, we're gonna take this out, the working one, and then we're gonna put in the broken one back into the DS. Oh, nothing's happening. Okay, so that means we must know that this is on version 1.55 and not 1.71, okay? So we take that out. Now we put the version 1.55 action replay DS in. So this is on version 1.55. Now we're gonna take this out and put in the broken one. See that? That's how you know it, it, this is the correct one because the mouse comes up. You're tricking the, D, the Nintendo DS system to think that it still has the good working one inside of it. So now we go to the computer. We're gonna plug in. All right, go to the updating screen. It has one game on there apparently. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna upgrade the firmware 1.55 to version 1.55 because that's, no, that's the one we know it's supposed to work on. Okay, now we update the firmware. This is gonna take a little, few minutes to do, so I'm gonna cut it and I'm gonna come back to it. Okay, after a few minutes, it's done. Saying, do you wanna update the firmware? And you say yes. Reboot now. So remember, when we turned it on earlier, nothing happened. Now after doing the firmware update, it works. There you go. And you can get these firmware updates, these files, from the Code Junkies website. Just Google Action Replay DS Firmware Update 1.55 or Action Replay DS Firmware Update 1.71. And then you can download them, put them on your desktop, and then click and drag like I did.